Hi, it's Paul here from bestwpwebsite.com and welcome to this video overview of Spacious WordPress theme. It's a free WordPress theme by Theme Grill and it's very nice, very nice design, responsive and so let's take a look. On the upper left corner we have a logo and site title and on the right side we have a navigation menu, we have a drop down list so it's very nice and a search bar here so here's a slider very nice with some text and read more button it's perfect slider for your posts and then we have the section of features for example or details and a call to action then we have a our latest posts or testimonials we can add what we want here and then we can add our portfolio for example and there's a rich footer with four sections we can add our widgets here for example recent posts or contact information and also the footer so this is an upper footer and maybe this is the normal one and yes yeah, so navigation we can see the layout there are four different layouts so yeah this is a layout with left sidebar of course right sidebar and no sidebar so it's just like a very nice wordpress theme which has many different options so we can change as we want typography also also nice so as you can see there's nice styling for tables for example and yes i think it's, it's a very nice theme and the, as i can see there are also uh, video tutorials here so let's take a look because i'm using this theme for the first time so i make this overview and I will try, and try to install it and customize so let's see this video slider setup services so these videos might be useful okay so now let's install this theme and the so I'm in the dashboard my of my site. site and I will click appearance themes and now I will click add new and search for spacious. So here it is. I can click install now. So now the theme is installed. I can click activate. It's as easy as with any other WordPress theme. Okay, and now the theme is active, so let's take a look of our site. Yeah, so there's our site, my test site, so there's nothing, no content, only two posts, dummy content. And yes, so let's customize this, let's try customize. And yeah. So, very rich customized menu as I see. And yes, let's check site identity, obviously, site title and tagline. Colors, so header colors here. Header image, so that is, I don't know what this is. So let's add an image and see. Okay, so I have one image here. <laughs> it's a screenshot of a different theme. So it's funny. Let's see. Okay, it can be whatever. It can be like this. It doesn't matter. I'm just cropping this image. It's very nice that I can crop this image here. So yeah, nice feature. And okay, so it's a header image. So it's above the um this site title and this navigation cause this is navigation I just have just one page mm, so I don't think it's necessary so I will hide this image 
because I don't need this. Now let's see background image. Let's select an image and see how it works. So yes, so it's just an image and the background. I don't want a background image, so also remove menus, of course. Menu locations, so primary menu. I don't have any menu right now. So add a menu, create a new menu, main one. And now I have can add this menu to primary location on footer menu. And yes, there is nothing because I don't have anything in my main one. So yeah. So don't I didn't want it to to be like this. Then now oh, the uh, widgets. So yeah, right sidebar. So okay, search recent posts. Very nice. I can drag and drop, of course. Yes, it works. So it's nice. Let's add a widget. Whatever, maybe text. So yes, <laughs> okay, here it is, so it works, that's okay, let's click save and publish, why not, and now header sidebar, so Let's see. Mm -hmm. So the test widget is here above the menu. So maybe we would like to add something here, but I don't, so I won't save this thing. Okay. Now, what is here? Widgets again. So, for widgets uh, here in the footer, there's nothing here right now. Let's add one. Categories. Here it is. Okay. So yeah, easy, yeah. Static front page, of course, I want to lay this post to be on my home page right now. The header is here, the logo probably. Yes, it is 100, 100 pixels. So, header text, right now header text. So add header image. If you have a header image, of course, you can change position here. So design. Yes. Okay. So that's nice one. Let's see. So now I've changed the widget, the width of the site. So. I will redo this thing, change it again because I want it to be wider. But it's nice that I can change it here. Okay, so default layout. As previously, we can change layout and for pages. So also nice. So I can change the layout for pages for a specific page. Okay, so it will be refracted in all pages. Unless unique layout is set for a specific page. Very nice features. 
and for single posts. So also also nice features. Blog post display type everything everything and design color scheme so let's change it to black why not perfect so and custom CSS also nice additional everything is here so it's very powerful this customization menu allows you to change everything you want so slider activate slider of course activate it and we have to upload an image select image can be this one choose image yeah so now we have slider Unfortunately, we don't have text, so it's just a readable button. Enter title. So, dummy title. Okay, it works. We have text here, so it's very nice. And we can change the button text. So, great, very easy, save and publish, and we have add up to five images, so that's also great. And about, why not, about, we have free support, documentation, demo, and we can, of course, upgrade to pro. So, let's see documentation, for example. Getting started, installation. I think it's it may be useful if you want to do some, do something spec very specific. Now you have everything is here. So as I can see, there's business business template. So. If you want to set the website as demo, you will need to use this business template. And there's a video, so maybe it can be useful for you to, to see this documentation. But now let's get back to our site. So let's go back to the dashboard. Okay, so now we are in the dashboard. Let's go to pages and see how this business template works. So add new, or maybe use the sample page. And change template to business, here it is. So update and let's see how it looks. View page. There is nothing, probably, because we have to add something. So let's add widgets, maybe. Widgets. And here they are. Business top. And... Okay, so it's that easy. So we can do everything from here now from the customize menu. It should work well. So once again, uh, I recommend you to check this documentation and it should be very easy to set up this website as you want. Also to set up is like a demo with your content. So yes, thanks for watching this video and subscribe to my channel for more useful videos about WordPress and WordPress themes. So, thank you once again and see you soon.